See, it's several hours before the Lahaina PM fire took off. And this is the traffic on Lahaina Luna Road coming westbound. And so the image is taken looking eastbound, and you can see those vehicles stacked up in line trying to go either north or south out of town. And the reason for that is because there was no power to, to control the traffic signals. As, as the infrastructure was damaged, as the buildings were damaged, and now the fire was raging, it created a, an opportunity for the fire to run very quickly through the community. So as an object burns and it begins to come apart and it's influenced by both the fire plume itself as well as the wind, pieces or particles break off of the burning object, are able to be carried by the wind, and then deposit somewhere else and possibly ignite what we call a spot fire. Now, this report is part one of a three-part investigation. Phase two will be the analysis. That's expected to be released at the end of summer. Phase three will have safety recommendations. That is expected to be completed by the end of the year. We're going to have more on this story on later editions of Hawaii News Now, including reaction to the report from Maui. And turning now